Some people have asked me for a better explanation of what these videos are, so I'll be including an intro from now on. A randomizer is a game where you have taken items in existing games and randomized their locations. These are called checks. Archipelago is a program used to randomize among many different games. In this case, Mario 64 and Ocarina of Time, which I switch off on and playing. So a chest in Ocarina of Time might have the key for the downstairs of Mario 64's castle, and a star in Mario 64 might contain the iron boots for Ocarina of Time. I then switch back and forth, trying to find the path that leads me to the end of these two classics. I hope you enjoy. I completely forgot why I was coming to this location instead of the other one. It was because I wanted to do that sun song up there and this. So I guess I'm not doing the sun song up there because my brain shut off and I started thinking about other things. Okay, so three checks, which are these back three, archipelago. I am a fool. And recovery heart. I'm assuming I already talked to you. Yeah. All right. Okay. Oh, you to buy their lemonade, not to buy you. Okay. I thought you were saying that they wanted you to buy them lemonade. Okay, I misread your thing. I'm sorry. Well, um, no. It's not a good business decision to try to pressure people into buying your product. If they're interested, they're interested. Otherwise, you're not going to be happy with it. Listen, hear me out. You have been calling me streamer all day. Okay. I'm assuming I can't just ride in. Yeah, of course not. Okay. Come on. Let me off. Stop trying to speak. There. Link stopping social. <laughs> Try to equip that, but it glitched out for a second. I don't have the Zora tunic at this point. Lame. Well, so you say corrupt moderator, I say, like, the only moderator who actually gets on anymore. And she doesn't even do that that often because she sleeps. She goes out and does things, then gets home, says hi, watches me stream for like half an hour, and then leaves me. <laughs> I don't plan on beating the boss at the moment. Mainly because I don't have to, I don't believe. But, you know, I wanted to see whether or not that would be a thing in there. The moment I get what I want from this place, I'm leaving. Which reminds me, what is the name of the check I'm going for here? Uh, I'm going for one central... 
bow target pot. The hell does that mean? Central bow target pot? Yes, I lower the water level, use my bow on any pots in the center. I don't know, then. Maybe it's the one literally right down there. That would be amazing. Rather than play correctly. Dins fire. One sick, I can hit Baronade. And that's it. The problem is, I don't even know if it's in this room or if it's in the like, center tower. I don't know if it's in some side path. I really don't know. I also don't have the frickin' keys. I don't need them. I don't need them, technically. I don't need them. I can save warp. I can use fire to get in the middle. That's probably what I'll need to do. I better not need the keys. Because so much of this place requires keys. save work now. tower via this. This actually saves you a key technically, so you don't need every key to beat this dungeon.
So I'm gonna go back out here before I raise the water levels. Center target pot. What would that even be? Probably neither of those. struggling so hard to figure out what I need to do because I, I was fast enough to get over there and I was getting so frustrated until I realized that I could just use a bow. I was so dumb. <laughs> I felt so dumb at the very least. I was, you know, like 12 at the time, 10, 12 right in there. Because I had never beaten the game on my own. Stopping so testy. There it is, golden gauntlets. So this is the center target pot. Whatever that means. Central bow target pot, two. I guess the central is like the center room or whatever. And the bow target is the one you have to shoot. Got it. All right, I am done in here now. Tad streamer. Have you watered your plants yet today? No, I have not. Um, realistically, I actually need to go down and water fairly soon. Um, I know you're talking about Amori, but I'm talking about real life. Uh, I might be able to go beat the game now. So I'm going to go check to see I'm not forgetting anything. And if so, I'm going to go beat the game and be completely done with this randomizer, which I had a lot of fun with. The next time I do a Zelda randomizer will probably be when I do Ship Arcanium. I'll go in, I'll randomize most things, and I will probably have crowd control on. So people will be able to mess with me, they'll be able to hurt me in different ways. Um, I'll turn off most of the things that give me powers. Um, and just have a silly time. I also will probably have the requirement to get into Gan's castle being Greg, which is Greg the Green Rupee. You will find a single green rupee that's out somewhere out there in the world, and it unlocks Ganon's castle. Very silly, and I love that. I also have a bunch of randomized music as well. It won't even be Zelda music. So, silly, silly. So I have the light arrows, which means I can go and finish off this first. Okay. Light arrows. You know what? At some point I should probably go through all the songs and figure out just specific songs that I want randomized. Like, I'm pretty sure Malomart is one of them, and 
I would love for that to be just primary focus. Fucking Mad Little Mark, Mad Little Mark, so you're sold to the Mad Little Mark. Bum 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 bum. Bum bum bum. Mad Little Mark, Mad Little Mark, so you're sold to the Mad Little Mark. Dang it. Mmm, I'm not sure this is possible now. Okay. I will give this one more shot with this. If I don't even come close, then I will go and grab the fire arrows. I was hoping I wouldn't have to go get them. I don't have them. Just, just go. Just go. I'm, I'm just gonna go get the fire arrows. <laughs> Save warp to get to the uh, thing, which will be faster. I had decent starts on these. Especially by the time I had gotten the adult, I didn't need to do, like... I had everything I needed, pretty much, to get over here. So it was convenient. It wasn't just an inconvenience of having to run down the mountain. I wish I ever got the magic upgrade. That would have been nice. to me the gold gauntlets are actually a blue color and that looks pretty nice with my cobalt in it. Like, if I were to cater through a bunch of the songs, which I probably will do before I uh, do a randomizer with them, because there are a bunch that I just either don't care for or don't really know. Some of them are neat. Like, I haven't gone around playing Sonic Unleashed, but I heard one of those when I was testing out Ship Arcane last time. Um, and some of them are good like that. I just don't really know them, so I don't have an attachment to them. But if I were to get, like, freaking Malmart and a bunch of other that I really know and I really love, I'd love it. I'd love it if somebody had added, like, Mega Man Legends music in there. That's one of my favorite games in the world, period. Hard stop. Okay. This will be... Um... Not the best when it comes to figuring out where it is, but it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Well, it won't be hard to find it. It'll just be getting over to it. Was that it over there? Or is that a re that's Reppy? Sink all the way to the bottom and walk around. Grab the keys along here. G. There's the fire arrows. Who's directly beneath me? That's why I can see it. Alright. Not gonna bother grabbing anything else. I don't need it. I don't need it. I don't need it. I really don't need it.
takes so long to surface. You know what? Just... I completely forgot that was a thing. I have the gold gauntlet, so I can use that to go and recharge my magic. Because I was like, how am I going to get magic? Ah, right, Great Fairy. There's also the final Great Fairy. So, you know, completion or whatever. God, I wish the bunny hood was on as an adult. I got a taste of it right at the end of the game, and I wish I had had it so much sooner. Oh. I moved my phone to check something, and now an egg's about to hatch in Pokemon Go. Look at me. You absolutely have permission to go to the restroom. Go piss, girl. Realistically, I should go get, like, a green potion or something, but ah, I'm fine. I'm not gonna run out of magic and cry. I'm probably gonna run out of magic and cry. Just some heads up. Well... It was a glaring Meowth, and I do not care. Sorry, I was just putting a, uh, another egg in. I'm egging, egging you. Probably should check the other pot just to be sure, but eh. Who cares? I don't. I don't end up dead. Yeah. 
Yep, sure enough, there was one. Yeah, requires gold gauntlets. Good to know. Which I already kind of... I don't know why I did that. I knew that was going to happen. I took one look and I went, yeah, that'll... Wait, why did why I keep running? What? No! Come on. Quit, quit doing this. <laughs> I just keep panicking slightly. That's great. That's great. Patience. One step at a time. Stop rushing. Remember the one thing Call of Duty ever taught you. No rushing. I say that as a joke. Um, I, like, spent no time in Call of Duty. I used to play it back when I was a kid, but it was purely multiplayer. I say kid. It, I was a kid. I was, like, 12. And... It was Call of Duty 4, and I just purely played the multiplayer. I, I, my friend kept trying to get me to play the story with him. I just did not care. I've never cared about a Call of Duty story. Never had me entranced. I was like a Halo kid, so. Sent audio message, did you? Neat. We're at the end of the game. I shouldn't go straight there, but I'm going to. I do have Ganon's Castle boss key, right? I got that early on, right? Yeah. I win. All right, boss key chest contains 50 bucks. I honestly expected five, so <laughs> six, six, nine, nice. Oh, 
I win. Sadly, no magic. Uh, and that was rupees. I thought it was thought it was gonna be hearts because I have the green hearts. I ruined the perfect money. Damn. Not like this. All right. Anything here I care about? A bunch of money. Me being a fool. Me being a fool again. Alright. In the end, it doesn't even matter. Don't don't fucking link myspace.com. The last I heard is that it was bought and apparently being rebranded into some kind of like celebrity hotspot thing. Which... Why? I've worn the spell, it's really neat. I'll keep it later for your treat. You would never beat me or fight my lightning bolts and unleashing the arrows from the Shadow Temple. Cool. It's been a while since I fought you. Oh right, he doesn't like you being in the center. And I didn't have my hover boots on, apparently. It has been a very long time since I fought this guy. Come, you're... Seriously? What a bitch! I know it's possible, I think it's what possible to one cycle him. Either one or two cycle him. You have to not only get fairly lucky, but also be very skilled at it. Two cycle, cool. I do have games on my phone and uh, you don't get to play them until you're finished watching the stream. Boop, boop, boop. Full heal. This is surprisingly going fairly well. <laughs> Transformation music. Do, 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 do. <laughs> I'm not doing that. <laughs> Even if I could, which I can't, I would not do that. Also, he kind of already looks pregnant currently. I guess that's Ganon, technically. <gasps> Hello, my pistachio ice cream looking friend. This is about her.
sliding a bit too much. Oh, come on. Take hits this guy takes. I mean, he is Ganon. But he is also fairly easy if you just roll between his legs. Alright. Master Sword ready. Equip now. And I win. That's game. Zoda pops in to try to steal the kill. And fails. Master Sword gets a buff for reasons. And boom, boom, boom. Game over. And that was my randomizer, my cross randomizer between Ocarina of Time and Mario 64. I beat both of them this stream. It took me about four hours, but not too hard. Ancient creators of Hyrule now open the sealed door and send the evil incarnate of darkness, incarnation, whatever. Blah, blah, blah. I know what this is always. If you're watching this, you probably have seen this before. And we did it. <laughs> we are officially done. I, uh... Hmm. I should probably stop it here. You. Curse you, Zoda. Curse you, sages. Curse you, boink. <laughs> it's still funny. Um, guys, I'm actually going to cut the stream here. Thank you all for coming out. This was a lot of fun. I had a good time with it. Thank you, anyone over on YouTube who's going to watch this because... It is all just for the sake of fun. I plan on doing a lot of different randomizers, of course. For now, I'll be focusing more on Amori and whatever my second game's gonna be for a while. I'm glad this only took, like, what, three streams? This is, a, you know, pretty much an appropriate length for this. I was way too buff for this point. <laughs> 
Um, I was pretty much, like, that wasn't even hard. And then you look at a bunch of the other games I'm playing, and I'm, like, barely scraping by. So, I got really lucky this time. So, thank you for coming out for this, and I hope you all have a fantastic day. See you all next time. I'm a hop off. I need to go and take care of the dog, the dogs, and uh, water the plants. So, boy. I've never really had Popeyes. I've never gone and got it myself. I've had some leftovers from somebody once. So sure, anytime, Crim. Boy. <laughs>